I feel excited. I can wait. Give you guys a show. Put on some entertainment and uh, hey, just have fun. Yes, people, so I'm back from Dubai, back at my home gym, Ultimate Fitness, and yes, I brought sir. special guests all the way from Binos Gym. Yeah, Andrew Jack, been four days out from the Arnold Classic UK. So, we're going to have a push session with him, chest and shoulders. He's going to take me through a little workout. And Nothing triceps, done for triceps. Nothing too crazy today. So, he's four days out for competition, so yes, it's going to be easier on me. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and let's get into the video. Let's go. Yes, sir. I always feel the same, energy-wise, like, at home, yeah, I might be dead, but I walk into the gym environment and I'm different, yeah. It's like, uh, I'm like a, you know, like a, a robot. Yeah, you program. What I'm in the gym, it's a different me entirely. I'm not here, I'm here to work, everything you always have. Yeah, the fly affects you too, obviously, right? Yeah, like, personally, it affects, but, but like I said, in the gym, and something else. after the workout I might go home and be dead. Yeah, I think once you train yeah, yeah. you'll feel better, you'll get yeah, yeah. into routine again. This is cable fly, yeah? Standard cable fly. We're not going low, we're going uh, middle. Middle to chin variation. Target is 96% the shelf. It's very precise, nice. Like yeah. Sense. Top shelf. You don't feel anywhere else, just the shelf. And if you're not, if you're, yeah, and if you don't arch your back like properly, yeah, you don't feel, you don't feel it's like you're, you're just like working out your front delts only. So what happens if you haven't got a chest to start with? <laughs> you just have to just, just arch your back and definitely it will grow. Yeah. Yeah, it's just it's just it's moving. This you get a nice squeeze at the top. Yeah, nice just arch section. and that's it. You arch a different thing entirely. You curve different thing entirely. Yeah. I'm quite embarrassed to say. I've done it on a different bench. Oh yeah. Forgot, so we started, started on a pressing movement, going to fly, back to pressing, so we did an incline press, sort of a mid-range cable fly, now we're doing a flat press on the Atlantis chest press, one of my favourites. This is probably the size of Jurassic's toilet. No, I would say, I would say it depends because it's quality. For me, it's not, it's not about the size of the gym, it's about uh, how equipped is the gym. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And it's got all the basics. And it's not just uh, the so-called name, but it's got the like the real names. Yeah, yeah, Hammer yeah. Strength, Atlantis, I mean. Well, like, because we're a mean? smaller gym, we have to have the best equipment. Yeah. Rather than having a gym that's too big, they just yeah. fill it with everything. Yeah, we have to be very selective what we choose yes. for this gym. Pop it off, come on. Pop it off. Again. Pop it off. So obviously it's four days out from the Arnold Classic, so there's no need to lift heavy, stupid weights, no put training to failure. Risk of injury is very high at this point, so the idea is to get some blood in the muscle, get the pump going, move the food around, get the water yeah. around. Yeah. He's obviously been on a long flight, so just to get a bit of a circulation around his body. Yeah. Get the reps high, got a lot of volume, but nothing crazy, nothing, no, nothing to failure. Uh, just nice and easy workout today. Yeah. No, no, no legs, no legs stuff. No, to show. hell no. Legs, legs, legs are when you train legs, it makes the legs hold a lot of water. Yeah, so yeah. <laughs> you want your legs as sharp as possible for show day. Legs is always 10 days before any show. Yeah, yeah. 
Ten days, really? Yeah. Mm. Some people do it a week. But notice when you stop training legs, they become sharp and sharper every sharp day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Of the delts, starting off with red delts as usual. Always get that blood flow into the red delts, most importantly. And we do front delts and finish up with a standing dumbbell. And that's what it is. That's I always start to read out first, yeah. prioritize, get the yeah. blood in there. Because yeah. yeah. everyone's got a strong front out, strong front yeah, exactly. So it makes it do it last. Rear dumbbell lateral raises on a supportive bench. On that bench provides more stability so you're not teaching as much as for isolation with the rear delts. You an old school dumbbell guy. It's just, you know. Energy building, massive shoulders. Oh, you know, now social media is taking everything. Everyone is doing everything for videos and uh, whatever. I, I mean, I mean, for me, well, I don't see only use straps on deadlift or lifting heavier back. But other than that, you don't see me with, with me, what, what, this or this or whatever. <laughs> no, I don't use it. And putting that on your arms and. Yeah. On cables, how do you feel the weight? Like, how do nothing you feel? Beats, like, nothing beats real weight. Yeah, you don't, you don't feel like you have to like have a connection. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. You like you have to like share that chemistry with the. Anyway. I lost my cravings. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, like uh, my last cheat meal was on 17th of July, I think, or 16th of July. You remember the date? Yeah, yeah. 16th, 17th of July. Is that in Vegas? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Never had, like, I lost my cravings for sweet, sweet stuff. I told me in Dubai, I mean, I bake her stuff. Yeah, yeah. And I don't eat them because I lost my cravings. It was uh, George. Putting cheat meals in the diet, or did you just leave it to you? To no, 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 no. Uh, he he's in charge of everything. He's a chef, so yeah. I mean, wh whatever he cooks, you know, like I just I listen and follow suit because he knows why. He knows he knows what he's doing, and I have to just like follow suit. And you know how you you lost your craving that you don't crave for. Junk or sweets anymore. It's crazy. The film says poor, poor Celine. She's not about to go out for food. <laughs> so, uh, no, no, no. We <laughs> like, have to take her out after the, after the show. No, take like, her treat her. Yeah, we have like gone out, but instead of like like going out, I bring the stuff home. Like I make the yeah, stuff yeah, at yeah, home yeah, and she yeah, have yeah, fun yeah. with it. So. <laughs> Full grown. All three heads of my tri triceps, you know, I developed it because of how I trained them. I don't train five, six, seven, eight, exi eight exi uh, exercises or whatever. I train only three because um, I start up with rope to hit the long head here and the upper one, and I do the uh, the straight bar or V bar, hit the big head of tricep, and I do 
skull crusher either on free weight or dumbbells or cables to hit the internal one and here also so I would say triceps are small muscle but not, not on the Andrew's case <laughs> it's huge it's so that's not easy So that is a wrap, that is chest and shoulders done, ultimate fitness with the one and only Andrew Jacks. Yes sir. Great session, thanks for uh, coming to my video. Four days out from the Arnold Classic, how are you yes. feeling? Oh man, I feel great. I feel excited. I can wait, give you guys a show, put on some entertainment and uh, hey, just have fun. <laughs> so this is the man everyone's talking about, so if you are coming to Birmingham, make sure you get yourself done ultimate fitness, get yourself done the NEC and give my man support yes sir like and subscribe we'll see you soon Go!